All right, so summary. This is the summary is. Okay. All right, so core sensation in the behavioral therapy. Uh, the reason being is okay, it is classified as a behavioral therapy. Uh, Versus it's not, it's a mixture of both cognitive behavioral, but it's like behavioral therapy, you get the end of the day, you're changing a person's behavior, right? You're changing the behavior of not to steal. So mechanism cognitively, but so result of the behavioral in the So I get that clarifies behavioral going to cover. So, <clears throat> yeah. So basically, uh, you wanna you wanna pair something that you wanna fix with something unpleasant, right? So yahan unpleasant kya hoga? in this case study ka example, yahan pe tum nausea le sakte. So basically, you change pair the behavior with something unpleasant so that the undesired behavior can be uh, reduced. So yeah, yahan pe jo puri summary ke you can see ke general information the way right but i i don't know why you can self cover sensation here glover ka naam mention to yahan pe glover ki case study bhi mention hona chahiye so yahan pe agar mention nahi hoga to once you write the general principle of cover sensation ke undesired behavior paired with an unpleasant image so that the undesired behavior is reduced you can then for example say aage you can write the case study by glover ye jo aurat wala tha so yeah, uh, how long do you write? Just say, you know what, Glover conducted a case study in which a cryptomanic patient had four sessions. Just can the Glover paired the, what do you say? Stealing behavior with nausea. And uh, the session lasted for uh, eight weeks. And after, what do you say? 19 months of follow-up, uh, the results show that the covert sensation worked in reducing kleptomanic behavior within the patient within the 19 months of follow-up she only relapsed once just short summary of the uh well put up detail again and you the homework we gotta get the we gotta we gotta get the right just just don't it's the information is okay there are other things to write about all right so explain one similarity and one difference between glover treatment and biochemical treatment yeah so you're supposed to compare one treatment with the other, you're supposed to compare one uh, cause with the other. So, apart from the obvious differences, biomedic chemical, behavioral, therapy, drug, drug. Yeah, you can write that, but you can write that covert sensations comparatively shorter. You gave eight half take a pura program, but biochemical is lambda. Yeah, lengthwise is different. Also, you can say, okay, you know what, biochemical side effect with that. Covert sensation as a side effect. You know that biochemical helps a person to become independent at the end. Uh, sorry, uh, biochemical help does not help the person to become independent at the end. Covert sensation does help the person become independent at the end, right? Okay, get the hand. I don't agree with the concept of treatment is deterministic. You can, I, this is wrong. Uh, one is deterministic, the other is free will, obviously. Uh, one is, kya kata hai? Both are reductionist. Tum ye guys, both are reductionist. That focuses on the biochemical only, that focuses on imagination only. So, yeah. Um, yeah, so like common sense wali answers, right? There's not much to it. So one more thing is you're supposed to understand is the wording of the question. They say that coarse sensation and biochemical chemical uh, There's like two variation of what they can ask. Let me show you the variation. If you remember the chapter of depression, right? Depression. Dono ke mark ek hai, dono variation ke, lekin dono ka jo wording hai na, wo sa farak hai. Jiske base pe tum phas bhi sakte ho, phas bhi nahi sakte, kahaan gaya hai wo. Ye hai, ye Y 
Yeah, 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 there we go. So yeah. One severity, one difference. Wo bhi ye sawal hai, ye bhi wohi sawal. Farak kya hai? Yahan pe drug treatments for depression likha ho, right? And yahan pe bhi wohi likha hoga. Drug treatment for wohi. Uh, biochemical treatment likha hoga, right? Masla nahi hai, wohi kabhi lafz hai. Covert sensation. Dekhi na, covert sensation. Yahan pe bilkul, there's nothing here. Between covert sensation, hata maage, covert nahi likha. Yahan pe kya likha hai? CRT. Thik hai na? Lekin yahan pe aage phir back ka naam likha hai. So what this means is यहाँ पे अगर एक्सपेरिमेंटल का नाम लिखा होगा ना जैसे यहाँ बैक लिखा हुआ है वहां पे ग्लवर का नाम नहीं लिखा हुआ हालांकि ग्लवर का पूरा केस स्टडी है सो वट यूर सपोज इज गिव जनरल डिफरेंसेस एंड सिमिलरिटीज फॉर एग्जाम्पल यू विल नेवर एवर रेफर द स्टडी बाई ग्लवर के भाई बायोकेमिकल ट्रीटमेंट के टू हंड्रेड एटी फोर लोग थे ग्लवर के अंदर एक बंदा था तो यूनिवर्ड ग्लवर की स्टडी इट्स नॉट अबाउट स्टडीज इट्स नेवर अबाउट स्टडी क्योंकि जब नाम नहीं लिखा हुआ ना बंदों का उसको वहां पे ग्रांट अगर ये लिखते ग्रांट वर्सेस ग्रांट बायोकेमिकल गिवन बाय ग्रांट एंड कोवर सेंसर गिवन बाय ग्लवर तो फिर या यू विल गो इनटू द सैंपल साइजेस एज वेल बट यहां पे एक्सपेरिमेंट्स को रेफर नहीं करना यू आर सपोज्ड टू टेल द सिमिलरिटी इन डिफरेंस बिटवीन जनरल कांसेप्ट्स ऑफ बोथ द ट्रीटमेंट तो ये याद रखना लेकिन जहां पे एक्सपेरिमेंट का नाम लिखा होगा वहां पे यू स्पेसिफाई उन का फिर एक्सपेरिमेंट्स के बीच में भी तुम सिमिलरिटी इन डिफरेंसेस दे सकते हो सही है So just make sure के वहाँ पे नाम लिखा के नहीं लिखा हुआ। Okay, yeah. Third, third uh, treatment for impulse control disorder. पहला था cognitive desensitization. Uh, Sensitization मतलब तुम वहाँ पे कुछ ना कुछ नई चीज़ बना रहे हो। अब ये है imaginal desensitization, right? Uh, the important thing is कि remember the word desensitization yahan pe imaginal and co covert almost mean the same thing wo imagination pe ye covert pe but the main thing is ki yahan pe d laga hua hai fir sensitization hai wahan pe d nahi tha aur wo seedha ka saada seedha se sensitization tha so blazinski nerve is about imaginal desensitization to basically inke bhi apni therapy hai थिंक ऑफ इट दिस वे कि थोड़ा का थोड़ा सा थोड़ा रिवर्स जाता है ये एज कम्पेयर टू कोवर सेंसेशन स्टेप वन वर्ड एवर द पर्सन इज वर्ड एवर द पेशेंट इज देर सपोज टू इमेजिन सिनेरियोज राइट फॉर एग्जाम्पल आप आई डोंट नो वॉट यूर अडिक्टेड टू ठीक इट कैन बी समथिंग स्मॉल इट कैन बी समथिंग बिग वर एवर वर एवर जस्ट जस्ट इमेजिन अ सिचुएशन दैट वॉन्ट्स यू टू हैव समथिंग दैट यू आर अडिक्टेड टू राइट इफ यू आर अडिक्टेड टू सम गेमिंग Imagine a situation which creates an urge in you. Can you go gaming? Get out of job. Can you go to the exam? Can you fail? Get to remove the stress. Can you gaming? Can you start? Whatever, whatever the situation, you just imagine the situation. Just keep it simple. You imagine that you have an urge to do the behavior that you are addicted to. So you imagine the urge, right? Once you imagine the urge, right? Obviously, all of us are imagination, but you're gonna be anxious. You're gonna be stressed out. So. हम इसके साथ रिलैक्सेशन टेक्निक्स भी एसोसिएट करवा सकते हैं सो वाई यूर इमेजिनिंग इट यूर सपोज टू डू आर रिलैक्सेशन टेक्निक वेर यू टेंस ऑफ योर मसल्स टाइटली डू डीप ब्रीथिंग एंड देन कम्प्लीटली लूसन योर मसल्स बेसिकली क्लोज योर आईज ठीक है ना एंड फोकस ऑन डीप ब्रीथिंग ठीक है डीप ब्रीथिंग के साथ साथ वॉट यू डू इज लाइक यू टेंस ऑफ योर मसल्स एंड देन यू रिलैक्स सो दिस इज प्रोग्रेसिव मसल रिलैक्सेशन वी डू दिस सो दैट द पर्सन कैन बिकम काम so we make them imagine the urge while making them perform pmr for a step second step is for example agar hum kleptomaniac patient ki example lenge so once they develop an urge right second step is to make them imagine the journey that they're going to the place where they're going to perform the behavior so you know if you're a kleptomaniac you're going to go to a shopping mall if you are a pyromaniac tum shayad you know what koi kachre ke dead baje jaoge wahan aag lagane ke liye if you're a gambling disorder wala banda tum casino jaoge so just imagine the journey right uh and and while you're imagining the journey bakayda pura journey imagine karna every single detail of it while you're performing the pmr the first step develop the urge second step is to imagine a journey third step is actually when you reach this place So what Blazinski and Nover would now do is when you reach the place, right? Shopping mall, punch get. Now you're supposed to 
imagine what you're feeling when you reach that show, shopping place. But so like they're gonna ask you, you know what, you're at the shopping mall now. So how do you feel? Like, are you excited? Are you like looking around? Are you like anxious? Whatever your feelings are, you're supposed to imagine your feeling as if you were actually there, right? So that, you know what, uh, the imagination feels as realistic as possible, right? So basically they ask you in detail, okay, you know what, what the venue looks like, what the temperature, kya, how many people are there, if you can count them, you know what, the music chal la, kini chal la, what, you, what are you feeling, whatever. So they immerse you in that imagination. And that's very important for the next step to work. Step number four is they basically tell you to now, uh, tell you to imagine yourself getting ready to do the behavior, right? Get the yarojao behavior karna se palas. So casino wale log ke saadiya bolenge. Imagine you're supposed, imagine yourself about to sit on the gaming table. Pyromania wale ke bande ke saad bolenge. Imagine yourself about to strike the matchstick. Cryptomania wale log ke saad imagine yourself just uh, that you're about to see an object. So ye important kyun? Kyunke you know that you know what. Right before you're doing something that gives you uh, pleasure, ek excitement masses, they are tension, suspense build hota hai, So this is important, kyunke yaha pe banda jo arousal excitement build karega. And the person in their head will just beg the experimenter, you know what, step number five, may just, just make me imagine that I'm doing that behavior now. Let me strike the matchstick, let me steal, let me gamble, whatever. But Blazinski and Nover, kya karte hai? They do something very, very unexpected in step number five. Step number five, can now, instead of making the person complete the behavior, step number five, can they make the person imagine having second thoughts. They make the person imagine having second thoughts right about as if they're supposed uh, they they're doing the behavior. And the second thoughts, yes, second thoughts could be about anything. Uh, you know what? I'm going to lose my money. Kya pata, lo, police pakar legi ki. Kya pata hai, na what? You know, Allah miya pasan nahi karing. Anything that gives them a second thought. Anything that makes them hesitate, uh, hesitant. You make them imagine step number five. So yes. So step number five is having second thoughts just about to do that behavior. Step number six is where the key thing happens. Step number six is after you make them have second thoughts, step number six is you make them imagine all the negative thoughts that they can imagine. That is going to come out if they do a behavior. Gambling karne ke baad kya ke negative consequences are like that. Sare imagine bro. Pyromania, same thing. Stealing, same thing. So basically, kya karte hain? Ye blasians ke no word jo hote na. Whatever you're, you're addicted to, uska maza barbaat kar dete, right? They just make it unattractive. That's what the entire therapy works upon. They get you to the point where you're so excited, uske baad sara ka sara maza harap kar dete. So that's what they're doing. So this is the desensitization phase. phase. Jo sara ka sara maza hai na, wo nikal dete. Ye remove kar dete. They delete this. So that's why it's known as the desensitization. Agar koi cheez dal dete, as nausea dal dete, phir wo sensitization banta. But because you have to get out so this is desensitization. Hai, and because you have imagination, ho hai, that's why it's imaginal desensitization. So basically, that's it. Step number one, imagine the earth. Step number two, go to the place. Step number three, uh, immerse yourself in the place. Step number four, excitement build. Karo. Step number five, have second thoughts. Step number six, think all of the negative consequences after you do the behavior. Okay. So when you think of the negative consequences, step number six, for conclusion, you take it, then you walk away without doing that behavior chup chup. You never end up doing the behavior in the imagination, right? So yeah, that's what they do. And this uh, Blazinski no work with you step number one, two, three, four, five, six, right? They're not done in one single session. Uh, they're done in multiple sessions, multiple sessions like this. And her session is between homework. The homework is known as the monitoring table. This is the homework, the monitoring table. So the monitoring table, kya hota hai? Agar tum ke, no ki, koi tum patient rahi hogi, so they're gonna give you a sheet. 
शीट के बहुत सारे कॉलम है राइट आई नॉट गोना गेट इनटू दैट बट बेसिकली द आईडिया इज मॉडर्न टेबल का क्या होता है द आईडिया इज दैट यहां पे ना और एक सिचुएशन दैट uh what a tri- situation trigger dikh the basically what this this column is is that you know what situations that made you have a desire to perform that impulsive behavior so maybe it could be a fight with your spouse jiske base pe you got stressed out jiske base pe aap gambling karne chale gaye so hota kya hai basically ye jo urge aata hai na ye jo step number 1 ke andar ये स्टेप नंबर वन के अंदर अर्ज आता है दिस इज बेसिकली जस्ट वन ट्रिगर एवरी सिंगल ट्रिगर दैट यूर गन हैव ठीक है ना यू फाइव विट यूर स्पाउस ठीक है वो सिचुएशन क्लियर हो गया सो यू आर नेवर गोइंग टू स्टील फाइव विट स्पाउस लेकिन वॉर इफ यू हैव अ फाइव विथ यूर बॉस उससे भी अर्ज आ सकती है सो बजन स्किन नोर विल मेक यू इमेजिन दैट यू हैव अ फाइव फिट बॉस देन यू वेंट ऑन स्टीलिंग then they are going to reduce the attack rate of stealing after you have a fight with your boss so they are going to make you imagine every single situation just urge aati and they are going to make sure ke har situation address hota hai jab tak koi aisa situation nahi reh jayega uh jab tak zero situation reh jayenge when you have the urge so that's what the monitoring table is it just makes you write down every single situation that makes you develop the urge to carry out the behavior and blazen skin nor are going to destroy that urge uh destroy the attractiveness of uh the urge every single urge so the motion table relies on you how um kya kehte hain how how honestly you write it you know how detailed you write it right for example if you think something is not a trigger the blazinski no worth ko baat pahunchegi bhi nahi hai kyunki aap form mein likhoge nahi but if you think something is a trigger phir aap form ke andar likhoge phir wo baad blazinski no worth tak pahunchegi phir wo uske upar kaam karenge so it depends upon your honest answers so obviously demand characteristics uh, in validity gir jane ka masla aata hai people can even lie as well um, so yeah that's a problem with this therapy to uski ye weakness hai monitoring table ki also monitoring uh, uske alawa you know monitoring table Uh, आपके पास हमेशा नहीं होता तो घर आए एंड यू राइट इन द माउंटेन टेबल यू माइट हैव फॉरगॉटन देन सो बेसिकली इट रिलाइज ऑन पर्सन हैविंग गुड मेमोरी एंड ऑनेस्ट क्या कहते हैं रिपोर्टिंग व्हिच इज वेरी वेरी हार्ड टू काउंट ऑन उसके अलावा कोवर सेंसेशन जो पुरानी वाली थेरेपी थी एंड ये वाली थेरेपी इट विल नेवर वर्क ऑन पीपल हु आर नॉट एबल टू इमेजिन वेल बहुत सारे लोग होते हैं जिनकी इमेजिनेशन बहुत बेकार होती है उनके ऊपर ही काम नहीं करेगा also uh, for this therapy to work the person has to be willing kyunki you know you can't make a person imagine if they're not willing to do the therapy right so it depends upon the person's ability to imagine and depends upon the person's willingness to do the therapy kuch aise cases hain jo ghar wale ko laate hain wo khud nahi aate to unke upar ye kaam nahi karta yeah so ye masla aa sakta hai right they can lie on the monitoring table does it have strengths yes it helps you to reduce the impulse control disorder so it does have its effectiveness it it is applicable and certain studies have shown ki it is effective up to 5 years so 5 saal tak banda kam se kam sahi rehta ki nahi rehta to bharat so ci ke hisab se summary kya hoga uh ci ke hisab se tumhe summary you're not supposed to write every single step right step one mein kya hota hai two three four five six mein kya hota hai no You're supposed to say, "Okay, you know what? The person visualizes a situation where they're about to carry out this behavior. Take it up. They imagine themselves. What do they say? Normally, what do they say? They imagine themselves carry out a behavior. They leave the situation, right? But what do they do? Second, what do they say? Second thoughts create. They do. And the person is made to imagine every single negative consequences after they perform the behavior, which reduces the attractiveness of the behavior. Take it." Uh, उसके साथ यूर गन वर्क उसको पी एम आर करवाते हैं ठीक है एंड उसके साथ मॉडर्न टेबल का होमवर्क देते हैं ठीक है मोर नथिंग मोर टू इट ठीक है ना सो इफ यू जस्ट राइट द सिंपल प्रिंसिपल राइट यूर गुड टू गो ठीक है 
क्योंकि ब्लजेंस की नोवर का एक पूरा का पूरा कॉन्सेप्ट है देयर इज नॉट एन एक्सपेरिमेंट ये पूरा एक्सपेरिमेंट नहीं इज नॉट इवन अ केस स्टडी दे जस्ट टोल्ड यू हाउ टू डू द थेरेपी सो देयर इज नो सैंपल देयर इज नो नथिंग सो इज दिस थेरेपी नेचर नर्चर इज कंप्लीटली नर्चर क्योंकि यू आर मेकिंग द पर्सन अनलर्न समथिंग यू आर रिमूविंग द अट्रैक्टिवनेस यू आर रिमूविंग द अरोजल बाय मेकिंग देम अनलर्न इट बेसिकली यू आर डीसेंसिटाइजेशन डीसेंसिटाइजिंग देम is it individual situational uh it is completely situational in the sense ke um agar aapne yahan pe koi negative cheez associate karwa di to obviously attractiveness kam ho jayegi agar aapne koi na koi yahan pe instead of having negative thoughts uh if you make them have positive thoughts so obviously attractiveness badh jayegi so basically it depends on the uh whatever is being associated here so it's situational uh person to person the content of the therapy might differ ये तो पूरा का पूरा यू नो और क्रेप्टोमेनिक पर्सन के लिए तो पायरोमेनिया द कंटेंट माइट बी डिफरेंट इवन दो द स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ द थेरेपी माइट बी सेम सो वो इंडिविजुअल बेसिस पे आएगा इज इट इज इट डिटरमिनिस्टिक नॉट एट ऑल इट विल वर्क इफ यू वांट इट टू वर्क यू इट रिलाइज ऑन योर एक्टिव इमेजिनेशन इट रिलाइज ऑन यू डूइंग द होमवर्क अदरवाइज इट वोंट वर्क इज इट रिडक्शनिस्ट यस वंस मोर इट फोकसेस ऑन अ क्या कहते हैं Uh, uh, you imagining things and you having negative uh you imagining things and you kya kehte hain reducing the effectiveness of it so it relies on your imagination it relies on basically the principle of unlearning uske liye aur kuch nahi dekhta right it does not consider biochemical perspective it doesn't consider anything so it's all cognitive oriented uske alawa reduction is nature nurture individual situation yeah i guess that's done i guess that's done in terms of application it is applicable it has no side effects right it because helps the person to get independent but it can be expensive compared to medications right if the process goes on long enough so there's that so explain the technique for imaginal desensitization so your technique wala sawal hai na एज अ सेट के याद ग्लवर की टेक्निक पूछ सकते हैं कि भाई कोवर्स सेंसेशन के अंदर होता क्या है सिंपल कॉन्सेप्चुअल डेफिनेशन सो दो मार्क के लिए माइंड एस यू के सिंपल कॉन्सेप्चुअल डेफिनेशन ऑफ इमेजल डिसेंसेशन सही सो बेसिकली छोटा सा छोटा आपने प्रोसेस बताना है कि क्लाइंट्स आर डन यू नो विजुलाइज दम सेल्फ वाइल हैविंग प्रोग्रेसिव मर्सल रिलेक्सेशन टेक्निक क्लाइंट्स ऑफ कोर्स इमेजन डिफरेंट ट्रिगर्स दैट मेक दम परफॉर्म डिफरेंट बिहेवियर्स राइट the persons of uh, as they are about to perform different behaviors they're supposed to manage negative consequences which reduces the effectiveness the attractiveness of the said behavior and and in their home they're supposed to do the morning table some short variation of that theek hai two advantages as i said no side effect it works uh it makes makes the person independent and has long term implications two problems with the margin table a person can lie and if they don't lie it relies on the memory so by the time they solve it they might have forgotten the instance so yeah that's the problem with that state two cognitive behavioral therapy so impulse impulse control disorders so you're supposed to remember the pehla cognitive behavioral kaun sa imaginal uh, covert sensation dusra kaun sa imaginal desensation so sometimes they can test you whether you know uh imaginal and cognitive concept therapy ke types hain so both are cognitive and behavioral kyun works on the cognitive level but the effects can be seen on a behavioral level all right the last therapy acha um yeah this relies on you knowing miller ki theory feeling state wali if you don't know miller ki feeling state wali theory won't be able to understand this therapy so yeah सो मिलर ने अपनी थ्योरी के बाद मिलर ने अपनी थेरेपी बनाई थी इस नोन से इम्पल्स कंट्रोल थेरेपी ये भी कॉग्नेट बेबल थेरेपी है सो बेसिकली इट्स अ कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ हिस्स थ्योरी एंड इट्स अ कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ ईएमडीआर तो बेसिकली ये मिलर की जो थेरेपी है ना इट कंबाइंस डिफरेंट थेरेपीज टुगेदर so to understand this ke miller ki therapy overall kya you're supposed to understand impulse control disorder ak- akele mein kya and emdr akele mein kya and how they are these two combined to make miller's therapy 
ये मिरर की थ्योरी है इफ समवन फोकस खैर लेट्स टॉक अबाउट ईएमडीआर पहले ईएमडीआर इज नॉट यूज्ड टू ट्रीट पीपल विद इंपल्स कंट्रोल डिसऑर्डर्स ओरिजिनली ओरिजिनली ईएमडीआर इज यूज्ड टू ट्रीट पीपल विद फोबियास एंड ट्रॉमास राइट जिनके साथ बुरे इंस्टेंसेस हुए होते हैं दैट दे वांट टू फॉरगेट उनके साथ इस्तेमाल होता है and the 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 effectiveness of emdr is measured on a scale called subjective units of disturbance scale basically ye measure karta hai ki tumhara kitna fear hai tumhara kitna anxiety hai ki tumhara kitna depressed basically all the negative emotions are measured on this scale kyun kyunki basically before emdr aapke sara ke sara negative emotions peak pe honge if emdr is supposed to work to after emdr aapke sara ke sara negative emotions बैठ जाएंगे लो लेवल पे आएंगे सो दिस इज हाउ यू चेक वेदर ई एम डी आर वर्क और नॉट सारा के सारे नेगेटिव इमोशन यहाँ पे होते हैं सो यूर सपोज रिमेम्बर इज दिस यूज फॉर एन इसके अंदर कौन सा स्केल लगता है ये तो दो लाजमी चीज सिंपल मालूम करनी है अब ये काम करता किस तरह है या This is used for trauma or phobia. So let's suppose someone um, has a trauma that they were kidnapped, right? Up, jab trauma hota hai, to basically, even if you survive the kidnapping, to obviously, ab kya traumatized hoto. So, is trauma ke saath na thoughts bhi jure honge, emotion bhi jure honge, physiological state bhi jure honge. So when you think about the trauma again see when you think about the trauma again jab trauma apne dimag mein andar laate ho so you start to feel all the negative emotions right you uh, sorry uh, you start to have all the negative thoughts as well thoughts bhi aa rahi emotion bhi aa rahi hai and your body will respond will start to have some physiological arousal increase heart beating shorter your breath so yeah so makes sense That when you think about your kidnapping incident again, आपके साथ emotion भी change होंगे, आपके thoughts भी change हो जाएंगे, and आपका physiological response भी change हो जाएगा. Now, if you're paying close attention to this, you have thought, emotion, and physiological experiences, right? Now, if you pay attention, this is kind of exactly the same of what Miller said. फर्क क्या है कि यहाँ पे emotion, thoughts, and physiological experiences are of a positive nature. Trauma के अंदर these three things are of a negative nature right so there's one difference ke yahan pe positive thought emotion uh, so yahan pe negative wale cheeze hain wahan pe positive cheeze hain but kyunki principally uh, the three components are same so miller, miller thought ke you know what this can also apply on addiction as well but anyways coming back on track emdr phobia ke liye treat karte hain uh, and hum iski effectiveness we use the scale All right. So now you know if uh, phobia has negative emotions, thoughts, and ph- negative physiological ph- physiological experiences. So basically, the 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 uh, logic is that you know what? When we have to process the trauma process, it is very difficult at the beginning. Why? Because when you imagine the trauma, then you will get the emotions back. So 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 you will they're going to get paralyzed negative thought ke andar negative experience ke andar emotion ka doob jayenge to hame sabse pehle iski trauma ki intensity kam karni padti hai so that the person can talk about trauma warna nahi kar pate so how do you reduce the intensity of the trauma this is where emdr comes in this sounds re- really ajeeb but uh, the thing is ke the person is supposed to kya kehte hain think of the trauma sahi hai so trauma ka incident apne dimag mein laaya and while they're thinking of a trauma the therapist is also going to tell them to keep a track of the hand movement to therapist kya karega patient ke aankhon ke samne apne hath ya ungliyan left to right ya upar upar niche hilaye hilate rahega right movement karega and the person is supposed to look at the movement of the finger they suppose track the movement to ek ek end pe जो पेशेंट है ना वो थेरेपिस्ट के उंगलियों को ट्रैक कर रहा है कॉन्शियसली एंड दूसरे एंड पर वही पेशेंट अपने दिमाग में ट्रॉमा के बारे में सोच रहा है टू थिंग्स हैपनिंग एट द सेम टाइम 
the idea is that you know what the brain is gonna get overloaded and the brain is gonna give up on one thing ya to brain jo hai na therapy se ungliyan dekhna band kar dega ya brain jo hai na trauma se thoda bahut uh kya kahenge distract ho jayega ki the brain cannot do two things at once so yeah so the idea is ke kyunki uh, trauma is in your imagination but the therapist fingers are in front of you in real life so your brain is going to side with the therapist finger the brain is going to shut off the trauma thing and the brain is going to devote its entire energy on tracking the therapist finger so yeah uh so iska ye matlab hai when once the brain stops focusing on the trauma and starts focusing on the therapist finger the trauma can density kam hote rahegi because the brain is no longer focused upon it so yeah so when the intensity is, is reduced enough तो फिर नेगेटिव थॉट की इंटेंसिटी इमोशन की इंटेंसिटी एंड नेगेटिव फिजियोलॉजिकल इंटेंसिटी भी कम हो जाती है देन द पर्सन इज देन फ्रीली एबल टू टॉक अबाउट द ट्रामा क्योंकि इट्स नॉट दैट इंटेंस एनी मोर क्योंकि द ब्रेन जस्ट स्टॉप फोकसिंग ऑन इट सो इट्स बेसिकली डिस्ट्रैक्टिंग योर ब्रेन राइट डिस्ट्रैक्टिंग योर ब्रेन टू फोकस समथिंग एल्स यहाँ तक थोड़ा बहुत क्लियर है वट ई एम डी आर इज या बिल्कुल नहीं समझ में आया अम सर या सर आपने जैसे अभी कहा दैट दैट द इंटेंसिटी ऑफ ट्रॉमा डिक्रीजेस इनफ दैट द नेगेटिव थॉट्स एंड द नेगेटिव इमोशंस की इंटेंसिटी दैट आल्सो डिक्रीजेस या या दैट अ पर्सन सो दैट अ पर्सन कैन एक्सप्लेन द ट्रॉमा बट देन दैट इंटेंसिटी कैन इंक्रीज अगेन आल्सो बिकॉज़ एज द पर्सन इज स्पीकिंग अबाउट द ट्रॉमा फिर भी तो उनको इफेक्ट हो सकता है लाइक यप फिर भी इफेक्ट हो सकता है लेकिन व्हाट दे आर यूज के पहले इतना ज्यादा है कि बंदा बोल भी नहीं रहा अब तो थोड़ा बहुत कम है कि बंदा चलो बोल पा रहा होगा सो लाइक दैट्स व्हाई दे सेड कि यू नो व्हाट अच्छा बेसिकली वी वांट द एंड गोल ऑफ ईएमडीआर इज टू मेक द पर्सन टॉक जैसी बात करने लगता है वहां पे कोई और टेक्निक लग जाती है नो मोर ईएमडीआर नाउ तो ये तो लाइक यू राइट की फिर बात करने से भी ट्रॉमा की इंडस्ट्री दुबा पड़ सकती है अब वहां से कम करवाना कोई और टेक्निक है तो वहां पे अभी ईएमडीआर का काम खत्म हो गया सो बेसिकली एंड गोल ऑफ ईएमडीआर इज टू रिड्यूस द ट्रॉमा की इंटेंसिटी जस्ट इनफ के बंदा उसके बारे में बोल सकता है ठीक है ओ ओके थैंक यू ऑलराइट सो या ट्रॉमा की इंटेंसिटी कम करवा दी बेसिकली हमने नेगेटिव चीजों की इंटेंसिटी कम करवा दी आसान लफ्जों में अगर मैं बोलूँ एंड इफ आई वॉन्ट यू टू रिलेट दिस विद मिलर्स थ्योरी इंटेंस नेगेटिव फीलिंग की इंटेंसिटी कम करवा दी बोल तो नहीं बोलना तो नहीं चाहिए लिखोगे भी नहीं कि इंटेंस नेगेटिव फीलिंग क्योंकि ऐसा कुछ होता भी नहीं है बट इंटेंस नेगेटिव फीलिंग की इंटेंसिटी ई एम डी आर से कम करवा दी जिस आसान लफ्जों में सही है और तो ये था ई एम डी आर ना वर अबाउट दूसरा वाला थेरेपी ये वाला जो है ये वाला इसके बारे में क्या है इसके बारे में ये कि दिस दिस थिंग राइट द इम्पल्स कॉल डिसऑर्डर प्रोटोकॉल राइट इसमें फर्क ये होता है कि इंस्टेड ऑफ रिड्यूसिंग नेगेटिव फीलिंग्स ये क्या काम करता है रिड्यूस द इंटेंसिटी ऑफ पॉजिटिव फीलिंग्स तो इसकी अफेक्टिवनेस कौन से स्केल से चेक करोगे सारा के सारे पॉजिटिव इमोशन मेजर करेगा फॉर एग्जाम्पल हैपीनेस एंड यू नो वट जो एक्साइटमेंट वगैरह तो इसका स्केल के ऊपर पॉजिटिव फीलिंग्स चेक करते हैं एंड दिस रिड्यूसेस द पॉजिटिव फीलिंग इंटेंसिटी ईएमडीआर रिड्यूस द इंटेंसिटी ऑफ नेगेटिव फीलिंग्स एंड इसका स्केल जो होता है उसके ऊपर नेगेटिव इमोशन चेक करते हैं सो द आइडिया इसके तुम्हारा पॉजिटिव इमोशन की इंटेंसिटी भी इतनी ज्यादा ना हो कम हो जाए एंड द आइडिया इसके नेगेटिव इमोशन की इंटेंसिटी भी इतनी ज्यादा ना हो कि कम हो जाए सो मेर देन कंबाइंस बोथ ऑफ दीज टूगेदर हाउ अब मालूम करते हैं This is it. So Miller says, "Ki you know what? We have a person who has who is a kleptomaniac, right? Miller says, 'Ki sabse pehle badam kya karwaenge? Sabse pehle aurs ke dimag mein na usko imagine karwaenge. So this is where the cognitive element comes in. Uske dimag mein imagine karwaenge ki wo chiza chori kar rahi hai, right? So this is the behavior, and usko hum feeling state ke saath associate karwa denge, right? So feeling state, uh, sorry, intense positive feeling yehi." एंड इसको हमने बिहेवियर के साथ जोड़ दिया 
Now, you know, this is a memory, right? The person isn't actually stealing. The person is associate, uh, thinking about this through a memory. So basically, it's a feeling state. A state-dependent memory, right? They're, they're recreating the feeling state, so it's a state-dependent memory. So, in their mind, basically, this image came. So, yeah. Intense positive feeling combined with the memory of a behavior. That's fine. Ab kya karega? Mirror jo saab hai na? Kyunke, because the person has now imagined the memory of a behavior and with imagining the memory of a behavior, uske saath saath intense positive feeling jo associated hai with the memory of behavior wo bhi aage. So ye basically ye dimaag ke andar cheez aage hai. So mirror kya karega? Ab aur se bolega bhai, you know what? Keep a track of my fingers. So the idea is the brain is going to be overloaded the aura is either supposed to focus on the finger or the aura is supposed to either focus on the intensity of the positive feeling that is associated with the memory of a behavior brain is going to be overworked and the theory is that the brain will start to focus on the finger movement because it is in the present and not so much on something that is in her memory so basically what the, the idea is that the intensity of the positive feeling will be lost because the brain will start focusing on it so at the end there is gonna be a stealing behavior right but what is this going to be associated with nothing you can now the stealing behavior is no longer associated with intense positive feeling how do you find that out by applying the scale on the woman positive feeling scale the idea is that is can you score come on say i got scores out of this code like a bhai come each other abhi bhi she feels super positive about stealing so is can aapka score kam aana chahiye ki stealing should not give you positive feelings if it works yahan tak clear all right so once you solve the stealing behavior यहाँ पे तुम गैमलिंग का भी ला सकते हैं एनीथिंग 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 विच टेकिंग फॉर नाउ क्लैप टू मेनिक फॉर नाउ रिमेंबर दैट मेरर सेट के यू नो वट वी ऑल्सो हैव टू नो वाई इज द पर्सन स्टीलिंग इन द फर्स्ट प्लेस यू नो दिस मेरर सेट दैट यू नो वट द पर्सन हैज अ नेगेटिव बिलीफ अबाउट दम सेल्फ के देर आर बैड पर्सन और देर लूजर सो थ्रू मेक दम सेल्फ फील बेटर दे स्टार्ट टू डू इन दिस वेयर टाइप ऑफ बिहेवियर थिंग होता क्या के इंस्टेड ऑफ मेकिंग दम फील गुड it makes us me uh, feel super bad you get they mess up so mirror kehta hai ki ab hame ye bhi theek karna padega wo kis tarah hota hai jo negative belief hota hai na this one i am a loser the person supposed to think of a negative belief focus on the negative belief negative belief ke sath jo bhi negative emotions negative physiological experiences and negative uh, thoughts aati hain wo bhi samne aa jayenge right now as the person focuses on that they're supposed to also focus on the movement of the finger you get it the brain is going to get overloaded the idea is that the brain will lose focus on the negative belief and start to focus on that this cause a negative belief can intensity become ho jayegi wo kis tarah pata lagayenge using the subjective units of distress scale the idea is that the score kam hona chahiye so mirror kehta hai ki this is how you treat impulse control disorder first get rid of the intense positive feeling associated with the behavior 